Brian here from Directus. I wanted to just quickly share a tip when you are using the WYSIWYG editor inside Directus. So over here on the left, I've got my front end, our marketing website that I've been working on. And then over here on the right, I've got some copy. So just a, a page block within our mini to any builder. Uh, more videos on that to come. But inside here, I've got this content and we can see this is how the links are styled, but a request from the marketing team says, hey, we need to add a button or we need to be able to include a button here. So how can I achieve that? There is not an option in the WYSIWYG editor for a button. Uh, and I just learned about this feature recently, even though I consider myself a directus expert, but let's walk through it together. I'm going to, I'm going to close this content out and I'm going to go into the data model and I'm going to go to my collection for the rich text that is displayed on the front end. I'm going to go to our WYSIWYG editor setup. I will go to the interface and I see there's two extra fields here, one for custom formats and one for options override. So the custom formats is what we want here. And Directus even allows you to use a template format here. Uh, you can fill with this template value to kind of see what effect this is gonna have. But I'm just gonna change this and call it my primary button. And I'm gonna erase the rest of this, okay? And I will do selector. So here I'm specifying the selector that I want to apply this custom format to. That's just going to be a, a tag. And then what I'm going to do is a classes key. Uh, and here on my front end, I've got a BTN class and a BTN primary for our primary button. So what this is going to do uh, is I save this that is going to add an option to our rich text editor, our WYSIWYG. So if I look for a rich text block, now I could go in and let's test this out. So we'll just do test button. I'm going to add a link for that. We'll do slash contact us. And now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna look for our custom formats over here and I'm gonna apply primary button. Now, if I take a look, at the source code, I could see that Directus has wrapped that uh, tag in a paragraph tag and it has applied these classes for me. So the effect I'm gonna get on the front end after I save this and reload, after I reload, is a button using my styling from the front end. So that is it for this video. I hope this is helpful to you. Stay tuned for more updates.